Importing your list to MailChimp doesn't have to be complicated. Let's see three options to get it done. Rod here, and welcome to Burn to Learn. These options are, first, CSV file, second, copying and pasting, and third, integrated services. Once you log in and are in the dashboard, click on Audience, and then on Import Your Contacts. Let's start with the first option, importing from a CSV file. Select it, and then continue to set up. If you previously saved a CSV file, just open it. It'll look like this one. Go ahead and organize the columns if you haven't yet. Make sure it contains at least an email column, since MailChimp requires it. But you can add as many columns as you'd like. I'll go with three, name, last name, and email. Great, all done with this file. Now back in MailChimp, Click on Browse, select the file from your computer, and click Continue to Match. Here you'll want to make sure that the columns you organized are matched in their corresponding categories. If any of them appears as unmatched, click on Edit. Choose the category that corresponds to that column and save. This is important because if you continue without matching them, those fields will be excluded in the importing process. Now click Continue to Organize. Then it'll ask you to fill out some fields. Do that with the information you have for your contacts. You can even add tags, which are customized labels to classify those contacts and keep them organized. This will be very useful to your campaign later on. Now click Continue to Review. Just click on Import and you're all set. Let's consider the second option, which is Copy and Paste. Just select it. Now paste your previously written and copied contacts. And click on Continue to Set Up. Then repeat the process we already went over in the first option. Read and check the box confirming that your plan may be upgraded if you exceed the free number of contacts. Now, the third option, integrated service. This provides various resources you can extract contacts from. If you'd like, click on Learn More for instructions on how to work with any of them. As an example, I'll choose Google Contacts. Just authorize the connection and sign in to your Gmail account. Now click on Add All to import all of your contacts information and accept the terms. And there it is. Your audience list is ready to be used. Good job. So those are the three options to import your list. Did you enjoy this video? Great content is coming up. Don't miss the next video of our email marketing series. Also, join the Inner Circle, our technical skills learning accelerator.